Following up on the new law that splits the Department of Public Safety into the Department of Corrections and Rehabilitation and creates a new Department of Law Enforcement. But what does that mean for you and crime? KITV4's Jefferson Tyler joins us now with the answer. Jefferson. Well, starting this month, a transition team is being assembled. In addition, $900,000 is budgeted to get the Department of Law Enforcement up by 2024. A new training center will eventually be built as well. But the reorganization of several state agencies into this new department opens up some real possibilities. More focused, faster prosecuted, uh, prosecution. Um, you'll see more uniforms out there on the road. Um, um, helping to, to have that visual um, um, deterrence and stuff. Um, better trained officers across the board, um, investigative uh, capabilities that we currently don't have. Department of Public Safety Chief Deputy Deborah Walski is excited that the name of his current department is going away and a new one is taking its crime fighting responsibilities. A new law has created the Department of Law Enforcement, which will unify multiple state agencies. But if we're able to expand our operations on the neighbor islands to include those things, we can take a portion of that, that pressure off the county police. The State Harbor Police, DPS's patrol and investigative units, narcotics, the attorneys who handle their cases, and the drug canine unit will now be in the same department. We have a pretty good canine program on this island. We don't have that same program on the neighbor islands, right? We're not able to focus that, um, um, I guess, budgetarily and be able to expand that project. Whereas we would like to be able to expand that project to have those those canines in the airports on the neighbor islands, to have fugitive operations on the neighbor islands. Personnel is expected to come over from the other agencies. That budget that's that's assigned to the Department of the Attorney General Investigative Division will merge over into this DLE. The Harbor Police budget will merge into the DLE. The Sheriff's Division budget will merge over. Admittedly, some of those agents' budgets may shrink, but the hope is that the process for catching and prosecuting criminals will improve statewide. Streamlining those investigations will allow for a quicker investigative follow-up. It will allow for better prosecution and, and, and uh, better cooperation with our other agencies, our, our fellow agencies that we work with. Now, the Department of Corrections and Rehabilitation is the other piece of this puzzle. Those personnel will now concentrate on jail and rehab portion of crime and not have to deal with catching criminals and their prosecution. That's set to be running around the same time as the Department of Law Enforcement. Jefferson Tyler, KITV4 Island News.